guys and welcome back to my youtube channel called the noble socialite today we are going for a lavish iftar at one of the most luxurious restaurants in bahrain it is truly an unforgettable unique ramadan experience for me Upon arrival, I was welcomed by a beautiful girl who actually took us to the dining area and here we are. As you all know by now that I'm a passionate foodie and I love eating delicious food, home cooked or in restaurants. So this is the place guys, welcome to the world of the delightful flavors and luxury dining with an exquisite setting. Here you can enjoy a typical Arabian evening that takes you on a culinary journey of Ramadan flavors. Savor the delectable tastes of scrumptious Arabian feast, iftar and gabga in glittering stars. One of a kind experience for me with flavors bursting in every bite I had. I mean what's more precious than spending a delectable iftar or gabga with your friends and loved ones in a setup as beautiful as this? While they prepare my food, let me show you around. Celebrate the spirit of togetherness and I'm sure you won't regret. Take your friends and loved ones on a lavish gastronomical journey courtesy of the talented chefs. They make sure that each guest is safe through their safety protocols and precautionary measures. So guys, after the waitress showed me the menu and explained every dish, I ordered harira soup. This is my first time I'm not going to have a harira soup. So let's try it and see how it tastes. I'll give you a feedback soon. Guys, I have already opened my fast and now I'm having a harira soup. It's called harira because it's a mix of chickpeas, it has uh, noodles, it has bits and pieces of meat and it's amazingly delicious. Trust me, you will love it. Elevate your iftar and ghabga with these special Arabic and Mediterranean specialties. If you are looking for the perfect feast to share with your family and friends, this Ramadan season, this should be the first choice. I started off with having cold meza. This platter has everything you will love. Every bite is so delicious. It has salad, it has some pickles, some labna, and of course it is served with Arabic bread. Starting off with some green stuff to fill my stomach because I don't want to eat so much after iftar. You can see I'm having uh, all the green stuff here. Uh, there is salad, there is labna and of course uh, there is fatouche, there is Greek salad. It's a combination of different salads. So I'll show you the bite now. As you can see I'm trying to eat healthy in the beginning and let's see. 
time for some hot mezza and this platter the small portion has everything in it it has kibba it has uh, falafel it has some uh, spring rolls and obviously it's served with the the garlic chutney or the sauce i should say and it is so flavorful it's amazing i love every bite of it and guys finally we are having the main course i was already full oh my god all right so let me tell you about the whole package we had for our iftar and gabga the whole package consists of soup of your choice hot and cold mezza perfectly seasoned and tender chicken plus the restaurant's delicious rice make sure to pair it with a special sauce for a more flavorful kick tender mixed grills a tasty speciality noodles a fresh take on an arabic classic that will surely leave you all wanting for more as well as their own special beverages like mocktails and cocktails a refreshing and light drink that will perfectly complement your meal This Uzi style slow cooked lamb leg is to die for. Indulge your senses in a mouth watering combination of fragrant spices, tender meat, and aromatics. Oh my god, that's a lot of food. As you can see, there's not one, two, or three dishes, but so many, seven or eight of them. Let's dig in guys. Now I'm confused where to start from. But before I start, let me show you up close of all these dishes. So what are we waiting for? Let's dig in. Come on. I can't wait. I'm really hungry. Although I was so hungry, but to enjoy every bite, I had to slow down, take smaller bites, chew my food thoroughly, and put my fork down between bites. I was curious about the food and took my time to concentrate on why the food gives me pleasure like the smell, taste, and texture. Enjoy the aromas of my favorite Ramadan meal, and I just loved it all. Ramadan wouldn't be Ramadan without a traditional tea serving, isn't it? A mouth-watering combination of everything deliciously tasty. This is definitely one place that will not disappoint you. Sink your teeth into hearty servings of Arabic specialties without burning a hole in your pocket allowing you to enjoy more and more and more i loved the ambience and i'm sure you all would love it Thank you all for watching my videos and supporting me. Please do not forget to give it a big thumbs up, share it with your friends, leave a comment and subscribe my channel. I would really appreciate it.